Hi, this is Amy Winehouse, and you're watching me on ITV.com. I think it's more poignant now um, because um, <laughs> because um, last time was very like screw you everything went wrong I do what I want this album is a bit more like we tried. Thinking on you in the final throat. You don't really think of who might listen or who might not or who you might lose out to because you change your direction or who might who you might who might buy into it more because you change your direction. You know I just reflect what I've been listening to, really. Um, I've always been like that. This is when my was a Number one, I write about love, or I write about things that I'm torn about or that conflict me, and I wrote, and I always write autobiographically, always. Run out to meet your chips and the Crystals had a song called He Hit Me, and it felt like a kiss. Like, that's messed up. There's only a certain percentage of people that would understand what that's about. Most people would be like, how dare you promote domestic violence? But to me, I'm like, I know what you mean. I know exactly what you mean. You say when we married, cause you're not I think it's really cool. It's been in the, he's been in the pipeline for like three years even, but he just, uh, he's as shit as me. We had numbers for each other two weeks ago. And then it all kind of went downhill. I mean, it's it's one of them things that I'm sure he'd love to do it, I'd love to do it, but it's not, you know, it's not a burning, burning thing that both, a burning desire that both of us have to do it. It'd be really nice, really. I mean, he is one of the most eloquent and well put and uh, gentle songwriters, uh, br gentle and brutal songwriters of our, of our age. I I asked first thing I got thrown out by a local because she did a racist slur. And I was like, well, that's me, obviously. But I'm so not racist. I'm so like, I'm like a black boy in a, girl's, in a white girl's body. I really am. He's in a place, but I can't get joy. Um, what was it the other day? I did the AOL music thing at Coco. My manor, my manor, Camden, yeah. And Peaches Geldof was there. She was presenting. And when I come off stage, so my manager goes to me, Amy, uh, when I come off stage, my manager goes, Amy Peaches has left, there's no one to, rep to introduce the sugar babes. And I went, oh, I'll do it, can I do it? And he went, no, 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 it's not right for you to do it. And I went, please. And then the next day, Amy bullies Peaches or something like that, Amy's got no class or something stupid like that where Peaches was having a wee and I'm banging on the door going, hurry up. And then she comes out and as she was coming out, I went, brat, under my under my breath, but I would never say brat. If you were going to think of a four-letter word, wouldn't it be better than brat, really? Like I knew I would. Such a loving, maternal person, but alcohol just gets a hold of you. The thing is, is that all news is good news, and if one person reads the paper and thinks, what, she punched who? She said what? And goes, she must be mad. I'm going to buy her album. She must be quite cool because she's nutty. If one person does that, then cool. Yeah.